Hi there! I'm going to show you how to get this neutral eye look with a bold lip. This is the first bold lip option I'm showing you, a bright pink magenta. The second one that I'm going to show you is a little bit more fall appropriate. It is a dark vampy burgundy. But again, the basis here is that the eyes are very neutral. Only a few products and a few easy steps. The impact really comes from the lips. But we're going to go ahead and get started with the eyes. Now I've already done a lot of the prep work. I have my face primer, foundation, and powder already on, as well as I have primed my eyelids and done under eye concealer. I use the MAC Pro Longwear, so that is a 2 for 1. We'll be using this Eye on Neutral 02 Matte Eyeshadow Palette from Sonia Kashuk for the bulk of this eye look. I'm taking the very white vanilla shade on the top left hand corner and putting that all over my eyelid from inner corner to outer corner through the crease and up onto the brow bone. With the Sonia Kashuk eyeshadow quad, I'm taking the top left shadow just to add some shimmer to the inner corner and the lid. Going back to the Sonia Kashuk palette, I'm using the color in the center of the palette just to sweep through the crease and warm the look up. Once I have most of the color deposited into the crease, I'll go ahead and bring that down onto the lid. With a mid-tone brown from that palette, I just want to define the crease. So I'm dabbing this color into the outer V, and then I will start to sweep it up and lightly blend it through the crease towards the inner of the eye, but not adding too much darkness or drama to the neutral eye look. Next is my favorite eyeliner of life, Prestige Liquid Eyeliner in black. And I'm sorry I cut off most of my eye during this clip, so I'll just go through it very quickly. I'm doing a thin line with a bit of a wing on the end. It's my signature eyeliner look. I use this new product from Maybelline for my brows as L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara on the top lashes. This bottom lash mascara from Clinique. Here's a blurry clip of me applying Luminoso Blush by Milani, sweeping it back towards my temples into nothingness. Yay, lips are next. These are some products that you could use for the bright magenta lip. First, I'm going to line my lips using this lip liner from Jordana. Then I used the Fergie Lip Gloss in this bright pink color to complete my look. So let me show you lip option number two. Here are several different products that you could use for the darker burgundy lip. I've lined my lips and then I am going to use the NYX Butter Lip Gloss over top. Which is your favorite? 